I really got interested when I went to a woodworking show in 2007, I believe. And I saw some guys demonstrating. My wife and I went to a store and I saw a magazine and I started reading up on wood turning. And I saw a piece in the magazine that was a Christmas ornament that was 1 16th of an inch thick and it had a half inch hole in it. And I said, there is no way anybody could do that. And so I wanted to meet the guy that did it. And that's what I did. I researched and sought the guy out. And then I heard of a man that made a cowboy hat. And again, I said, there is no way. And that's when I told my wife, that's what I'm gonna learn how to do. That's where I am now. <laughs> so I found out who it was and I figured if he could do it, I could do it. And that's basically how I've done everything in my whole life. If anybody could do it, I could do it. It might take me longer, but I can do it. <laughs> I went to a class at John C. Campbell Folk School, and he was teaching a class there. It was pretty intense. And then when I came home, there was no one to teach you. So it was trial and error. And that's exactly what I did for the year after that, was just trying to make a hat. Never tried to make anything else but a hat. The hats that didn't make it was about 30 that either cracked or blew apart, that didn't look good. It was just a lot of intense work and broken bones and <laughs> stitches. And <laughs> you name it, it's happened to me. <laughs> I turn anything down. I have people call me about middle posts, spindles. I make bulbs, different things for art galleries too. My favorite still is making a hat. My name is Jerry Meesmer, and I'm the owner of Shop Two Woodworks, and I make wooden cowboy hats.